When it comes to hockey, no matter who you cheer for, there is one thing most Canadians can agree on right now, the sorry state of our teams. Of our seven NHL teams, only one is well positioned to make it past the end of the regular season. That's sad news for millions of fans. Mike Trillet reports. Dion Phaneuf may have taken his first face off. Touchdown! It was a deflating loss, or rather, another deflating loss. Seven in a row for those Leaf fans keeping score. And even for the most optimistic, it's tough to find a positive. Are they going to turn it around? I hope so. <laughs> that, that doesn't sound very confident. I know so. I know so. <laughs> it's easy to accentuate the negative during a seven-game losing streak, but two traditional Toronto doormats, the Toronto FC Soccer Club, well, they're 2-0, and the Toronto Raptors have made the playoffs for the first time in, well, recent memory. Proof positive that the sports gods giveth and they take it away. The take it away is happening in far too many Canadian cities. Edmonton, Calgary, Winnipeg and Ottawa are barely treading water. In Vancouver, well, the Canucks have gone from perennial powerhouse to the doghouse, seemingly overnight. If they want to make the playoffs next year, they really have to uh, pull their heads out of there. <laughs> practice today, the only leap with a smile was the mascot Carlton. They are promoting Earth Hour with Toronto's former mayor. The game tonight will be powered by green electricity because uh, you don't want the Leafs to play in the dark. Um, Maybe that might help them. <laughs> well, I, you know, they're, uh, they're going to come back. Well, that is inarguably a long shot. They have seven games left and suddenly on the outside looking in. They know it. They see the standings and they hear the chatter. Kind of tough not to miss, yeah. Um, you know, we, we're well aware of, you know, the situation. And, um, you know, team's got a couple of games in hand on us right now. And, um, you know, we're going to have to uh, finish real hot here in order to give ourselves a chance. If you're going to run and hide from it, you're going to wear sunglasses and hat and a hood and, and not walk about town. Now, that's not me. I'm going to go out and do what I do. i got to live. But with the playoffs, life would be that much easier. Mike Drolet, Global News, Toronto.